Okay, guys. There's your cue. Get it? There's your cue. I think it's your turn. I'm telling you that's your cue. It's your turn to do something. But it's also a cue. <laughs> I'm so funny. All right. Anyway, so this cue is my favorite type of cursive cue because one, it is cute. And two, it is easy. There is another cursive cue that I'd like to show you what it looks like. It looks a little bit crazy. And it looks like this. So this is not the type of cue that makes sense. It looks like the number two, but it is also a cue. But we're going to do our cue like this, okay? So if you um, put your pencil down because you know it's my turn, I'm going to show you this real fast because it's easy. You're literally going to do just a normal letter O and then put that little curly, and it's not even a curly Q, it's like a slide coming out of it. So watch. I'm going to trace a nice oval, and then when it touches, pick up your pencil. You're going to go to the inside and do it literally, it's a slide. Wee! That is it. That's all you do. It reminds me so much of a regular Q because this part goes on that side, and this slide goes out to that side. So, hey, that's so easy. Let's do it together. Pick up your pencil. Ready? So do an O so wherever you started and on that same spot when it touches, pick up your pencil, go on the left side and do a slide. We do another one. So do a nice O, nice oval O when it touches, pick up your pencil and do a slide. We there's in between room here. So do an in between. Ready? Do an O like an oval all the way around when it touches, pick up your pencil and do a slide. We all right. So you're going to do the rest of these cues. Go ahead and let's spell this word. Let me zoom in a little. Ready? Q U E S T. Quest. It's like a journey. If I'm going on a quest, I'm going on an adventure, a journey. Q U Q. Q and you are best buddies are always together. And there's another Q U Q. So we're going to turn the page to the next page. That's where the Q-U words are. And it looks like all of them are Q-U. So let's go ahead and spell them. Ready? Q-U-E-B-E-C. What word is it? Quebec. Quebec is a, like, province or a territory in Canada. Um, and that's Miss Mirwall is from Canada. I don't remember where in Canada, but you guys could ask her about Canada. Ready? Q U I N C Y. Quincy is that word. It's a name. Next one. Q U A L I T Y. What word is it? Quality. If somebody's giving you good quality instruction, that's like what I'm doing. It means it's really nice. Um, it's not like junk. It's really good stuff. All right. Next one. Q U E N C H. And that word is quench. Like if you want to quench your thirst, it means you're really thirsty and you want to like satisfy it. Last word. Q. U, I, Z. What is it? Quiz. Take a quiz like a test. All right. Now, before you move on, I want you to notice that both D and Q are ones that do not, the uppercase letter does not connect to the rest of the word. So if you look at this word Quebec, after you do your circle and make it turn into a Q, then you pick up your pencil and you finish the rest of the word for Quebec. Sometimes people will make it connect like this. They'll do their Q, and then when they do their U, they have it go right into the next letter, which although that does look fancy, it's actually not supposed to be like that. It's supposed to be the space where you have to pick up your pencil. We're going to finish all the Qs on 56 and 57. Get busy.